Hello there YouTubers and YouTube community. Today I'm going to talk to you about netbooks versus laptops. Alright, here we got a gateway netbook. Uh, stopped this not too long ago for my birthday. Great uh, netbook. Here, I'll open it up for you. If you don't know what a netbook is, which I'm assuming you should, if you don't, it's a small little laptop that is great for traveling and education, maybe if you go to a school, it's a little portable, it's uh, about the size of my hand almost, I have small hands by the way, so this is a really tiny computer, great for travelers, people that don't use computers much should definitely get one of these, if you're just on it for the Facebook, YouTube, Twitter, highly recommend it, now this is a Windows 7 starter, it's the basic package of Windows you get in this computer, in any netbook I should say. AMD processor, I got that over the core processor because it does a couple more future features that the core doesn't. Now this is a laptop so I'm going to show you size comparison. Dell Inspiron 1525. Now if you take a look there it's extremely small compared to the Dell. Now this is a basic size laptop for Dell. I couldn't tell you about the other companies, but they're all around the same size as the Dell. Now, this is the size comparison. Quite a bit smaller. Um, as you can see right there, it's really small compared to this. This is a wide piece of crap. I This is my old laptop, the Dell. A crappy Vista. Don't get a Vista, by the way. They're garbage. You can change it, which I'm too lazy and I don't want to spend the money on changing it, so pretty much just keep it like this and don't use it. I use this instead. Also, if you can see there, really hard, but there is a built-in webcam up here, which uh, comes with most netbooks due to the Twitter and Facebook and YouTube. And it, it it's great, it has an entire package here. I'll show you the specs. If you can see, AMD Athlon, the old processor, um, has 250 gigabytes hard drive. Uh, every netbook should come with a 10 inch screen. It's the basic size screen compared to this 23 inch, I believe. So it's quite small. I mean, if you have big hands, I don't suggest getting this unless you're a big traveler and it's a must-have for you. Uh, keyboard on this gateway. I picked this netbook, uh, especially because of its keyboard. I loved it. thought it was really easy and it's, the keys are really nice and spread apart and they're comfortable. Um, now, don't expect to get lots of documents typed up on this thing due to its small keyboard, but uh, it's great just for tweeting and Facebook commenting and stuff like that. Um, so this, uh, all about, let's just say, let's we'll start with this. Um, netbooks, um, if you know what RAM is, RAM is the speed of the computer processor. So it's how fast the computer runs, like boot up time and speed of movies and I guess pretty much, I'm not a computer expert so you can correct me, just don't be too harsh on me, but it's pretty much the speed overall of the computer. Um, it's what uh, RAM is now. Netbooks, they can only have one gigabyte RAM. You may be able to get two gig, but it's very rare because of how small they are. And RAM is a big, big chip in the computer, but there's a way you can uh, turn it into a two gig RAM uh, on the back of every netbook. Uh, right here, you can pull this piece off, and um, you can uh, get your own 2 gig gram chip and put it in there. It works with most uh, netbooks, and it'll increase the speed, but I have no problem with the speed of this netbook. So, I'm going to turn it on for you. Windows 7 is great, by the way. I highly recommend if you're getting any sort of computer that has PC software in it, I highly recommend a Windows 7 whether it be the starter package or the pro so it's booting up there you can see the screen difference right there here I'll turn this one on too 